morning, everyone, and welcome to Sunday School. Today, our story is the story of the feeding of the 5,000. Our story today comes from the book of Mark, chapter 6, verses 31 through 44. Jesus and the disciples had been working hard with many people coming and going and no time to eat. Jesus told them, come by yourselves to a quiet place and rest for a while. So they all left in a boat to go there. Many people saw them leaving and ran ahead so that they would be there when Jesus and his disciples arrived. When Jesus got there and saw the big group, he felt compassion for them. Because they were like sheep with no shepherd. He started teaching. Late in the day, the disciples said, This place is isolated and it is late. Send the people away so they can go buy something to eat. You give them food, Jesus said. But the disciples said, should we buy food that cost eight months pay in order to feed them? Jesus said, how much bread do you have? Five loaves and two fish, they said. Jesus told them to seat all the people in banquet fashion on the grass. And Jesus took the food, gave thanks, broke the bread and fish into pieces, and gave it to the disciples. The disciples set it before the people, and everyone ate until they were full. There were even twelve baskets of leftover. About five thousand people ate. Our story today is a story of a miracle in which Jesus took five loaves of bread and two fish and fed 5,000 people. Now, here's a thing to remember. Back in Jesus' day, they didn't count women and children. They only counted the men. So it was 5,000 men plus women and children. Could you imagine feeding that many people? Could you imagine the miracle that took place? Jesus was so determined to share with so many that he blessed it and gave it to them. What would it have been like to be one of those people there? How does God provide for you? I challenge you this week to think about the ways that God provides for you and that you can be like Jesus and provide for others. Before you turn to your coloring sheets, please join me in a moment of prayer. Compassionate Christ, you care tenderly for us in mind, heart, and body. Please open our eyes to the needs of those around us today and make us your hands and feet like the disciples in serving those needs in your name. Amen.